Hello everybody, it's the Gaming Dad here and we are continuing Plague Tale Innocence. We're going to be doing Chapter 5, The Raven Spoils. Laurentius told Amisha that an ancient evil lurks in Hugo's blood, and the evil is awakening. Shortly before dying, the old alchemist entrusted Lucas, his apprentice, with the mission of helping the orphans reach Chateau de Ombrage. There, they will finally be saved from the Inquisition. In this chapter, we're actually going to get four collectibles, one gift, one herb, and two curiosities, and two achievements. If you can like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell notification to keep yourself updated. Cheers! God, it's nice and peaceful. It won't last for long, will it? And I wonder how long Lucas will be with us for. Oh, he goes nice and peaceful. Makes a change. <laughs> Lucas? Yes? What does he have in his blood? There's an old story. It tells of the Prima Macula. The alchemists say it was the first corruption, and that it silently travels in the blood of certain families. But something happened. The great break, and the Macula awoke in Hugo's blood. But what will it do to him? The Macula cares for neither good nor evil. It evolves with its host. The change things. The world. You know, your mother and Laurentius we're trying to help your brother. But they failed. No. I think they just ran out of time. This is it. Hugo, wake up. Come on, we'll walk from here. It'll warm you up. <coughs> if we follow the aqueduct, we should arrive at Chateau d'Ambrage before nightfall. What that noise? Nothing. It's just frogs, Hugo. Frogs? <laughs> <laughs> he seems well. Let's keep our fingers crossed. Look, they're everywhere. Aren't you cold? A little, yes. Jump, jump, jump. Hugo doesn't seem to mind. <laughs> He's keeping himself warm. Yes. But he's too far from my liking. So Hugo's actually going to run away quite a lot in this... Well, in the start of this chapter. <laughs> but we're going to go to the right here and get the ingredient. Leather. Hugo! Where are you going? And he's disappeared again. We're just going to go all the way here as we've got a collectible. Well, we've got some rocks there, sorry. It's later on. We've got the first collectible, which will be a herb. Hey, look! I'm a knight! An English shield. Where did you find that? Over there, lying on the ground. Listen, Hugo. Put that down. It's not for children. You're no fun. Come on, let's go. And then Hugo runs away again. Do you smell that? Oh, it stinks. Yes, it's horrible. He can sprint like. Right, we're going to turn left here. And we've got an ingredient on the way, which if I remember is leather. It's just an open chest. 
So he never notices that we're going away from him. So we're slowing down so we can catch up. Anyway, there's the leather. And then Hugo's going to hold her hand and we can start running again. And the flower is just over there shining in the background. Oh. And he's going to put in her hair. They're so pretty. What are they again? Gladiolae. Ah yes, of course. Don't you like them? That's not a good sign. Hugo, they're flowers. Mm -hmm. There we go, so that's the first one. And now we can continue on with the level. We also need to hug a left wall as we're going to come up to a sulphur. When we get to a kind of waterfall. And then we go under the arches into the battlefield. That's strange. So there's a sulphur. Smells. It's coming from over there. Alicia, Lucas, come quick, look. And there's the battlefield. You can tell the music's changing. Oh my god. Are they all dead? We can't carry on. Amicia, we have to follow the aqueduct. Oh my goodness. Amicia, do we have to walk on them? I know, Hugo, but we don't have a choice. Do you think we are hurting them? Just keep moving, Hugo. Come on. So we've got some salt paper there that we can't actually use as we're full up. We shouldn't be here. Oh, the smell. It's unbearable. I feel sick. Don't look. Concentrate on the aqueduct. we've got some sulfur. And then the other side right at the back. We've got more ingredients. Some cord. We're kind of looking for torches. I don't think it's this one. But there is some leather again. Right, it's this one up ahead. There's a chest around the corner with more ingredients. Now, we're actually going to activate that now, because as you can see that horse in the background oh, the horse. is going to explode. Uh, oh no, the rats! Keep away from them! Amicia, they're everywhere! Hundreds of them! I don't believe it! So we're going to create two of these. I'm going to throw it, no. and I'm going to run across to here. There are people! Over there! there. We have Those aren't soldiers. We have to get out of here. What were they doing? Those were looters, looking for things to steal. But why? To survive, probably. Like us. And we can't use this old Peter again. We'll never get through. We need fire. Amicia, there's some wood down there. But there's rats everywhere. So we're going to make use of Hugo. Could you lend a hand? All right. So we're going to tap Y to get this trebuchet to go lower and once it's here we're going to send Hugo to go and get the stick. Hugo, you're going to have to go through. Yes, yes. 
Be careful. I did it. I made it. Good. Now come back. There you go. Ow. Well, well done, you two. Paralyzed. Now here's the first brutal death of this chapter, as we can see. There's a guard coming. Into the grass quickly. He mustn't see us. Amicia, his lantern. I I understand. He's coming. What? <laughs> so it's very similar to Ham it's horrible. as when they do like drop to the dead and drop to the floor and die. They're actually the rats are going to stay there. So it benefits us. Climb up, I'll help. Now we're actually just doing a wee side path here as we've got a few ingredients right in this chest. Well, we've got one no, two ingredients. Alcohol and sulfur are good, as I mentioned, we've got to use the ignifiers. And we're going to go under the bridge. We don't need to collect rocks. But we're going to continue on here. So we can go across here. There are too many rats. We're stuck. Now we're going to equip our ignifier to go like that. And then we're going to have to be quick here as we're going to aim at this. And as soon as we hit this, we're going to aim down here. There's so a guy here that we need to kill. Now we can loot him and see what he's dropped. More rocks, which aren't the greatest. We've got tools there. And then we're going to go up here for a few extra ingredients. Come on, get up there. Very well. So we've got a saltpeter that can't cord. Fabric. And we're fine for pots. I'll go first. Yes, of course. Somehow we've got to wait for Hugo to go down a ladder. Right, anyway, we're going to go and actually do one of our upgrades. <coughs> so we're going to upgrade the ammunition bag. So it holds up to 10 ammunition of each type. Amicia switches the fabric of her ammunition bag for leather, increasing its carry capacity. So we're going to hold the upgrade. There we go. Not bad. Not so bad now, at all. we can get more ammo. So I'm going to pick up the stick here. And as you know, we're going to run to the brazier over here. And activate it like normal. Oh no, soldiers! So, we've got a guy here we need to kill. Unfortunately, they won't let us aim at him. We need to push. Let me help. And we've got a guy over there. Get burned. We're making too much noise. They're going to start us. So first things first, let's stop here. And let's get a wee headshot on this guy. He's dead, the but the rats are gonna kill him. And we can't actually get him yet. Help me push. I'm coming. We're actually going to get a collectible up here, which is a sickle. And we're just going to stop here so I can see if I can aim at this guy. Yeah, we can. And that'll mean the rats will kill him. Right, let's continue on. Help me push. All right. Now, as you can see, the sickle is actually hanging out of the chest. We've got a pot there, but we don't need the pot. So we've got a card. A scythe. They're fighting with that. Not everyone has enough money to buy a sword. Come on, help me. Very well. <coughs> yes, we've got the alcohol off the body. Can you help me push alcohol is a really yes, important course. ingredient, especially for using magnifiers. Yeah. 
So there is sticks here if you require it, but we don't really need it to be honest. It's actually taking us like this. We can't actually go any more. Oh. We'll have to leave it here. Come on. Right, we've got the alcohol as well. Proper horrible. Come on, I just want to see. Yeah, but still. What? Rats are gonna eat him anyway. We need to pass below the aqueduct, Misia. But the rats are everywhere. So we're gonna wait for this guy to actually move. So we need to sit close to him and we're going to pick up the torch. We just need him to hurry up. Because we've not got all day. I can't fucking stand these rodents. You've got nothing better to do than muck around with a corpse. There we go. We're good to go back. Yeah, finally. Christ. All that for that. And what are you going to do with it now? Well... I'll have to think about all that. The coast is clear. Not a sound. I understand. So, we've got a place up ahead where we can actually put the torch back in and climb up to that ledge. But to the left, we've got a few extra ingredients that we can use to upgrade our equipment. We've got a cord, and we've got fabric, and rocks. And we're maxed out at 10 now, before it used to be only 6. There we go, we'll put that there and we'll climb the ledge. You go up first. I'm coming. <laughs> oh, so we've got some rocks there. So we're going to aim at these corpses. So over here we've got our collectibles and we've got our next one which is an elephant. It's called an elephant. Anyway we're good to go. This man was probably a captain. So we're just going to try and hug this as much as possible so they don't come over. Anyway we're going to climb in here and we're actually going to get the opportunity to get the achievement saviour which is save a soldier. So normally what you would do is you pick up this torch and you would continue on and eventually rats would go into this guy killing him. But we want to get one of the ignifiers and then there you, you and that will stop him dying. Thank you. Thank you. You won't give the alert, will you? The alert? No. No, no. I'm behind it than you let you. Go ahead. I didn't see anything. See, Good. so he's actually not going to die and it gets us the achievement. So we're going to go down here and our torch will somehow drop. No. The torch. We'll do without it, Amicia. And um, we've got some ingredients over here. A nice handy tool. Now, we're going to get a new ability here. But it's a very expensive ability. There's a soldier. He's blocking the way. I don't see any other way. Damn. We don't have a choice. We have to take him by surprise. Here, take this. What do you want me to do with this stuff? Somnum. You see, mix them together. So, Somnum, or whatever it's called, costs quite a lot to craft. So 
someone puts enemies to sleep for good, discreetly get close behind them and press Y. Like so. There we go. Is he asleep? Yes, for a while. Thank you. This is going to save our lives. So if there's still some somewhere in your inventory when an enemy catches you, you can use it in the last resort to escape death. Be careful. Costs a lot and penalises your future upgrades. There we go. So we're going to be coming to... Uh, it can, this can be quite annoying as... It's repeated. Just to get a collectible. Anyway, we're getting as much stuff as we can. So, we're going to get Lucas to activate this trebuchet and we're going to run all the way up there. While I'm waiting, I'm going to craft that. So, as we can see, it's taking it right down. And as soon as it goes up, we're going to run with it. Like so, we can get up here before the rats get us. Now, we need to activate this torch and send Hugo to get a stick for us. And we'll collect these while we wait for him. And the annoying thing is, we have to wait for that to stop, to then get Lucas, do it again. Can you do it? Then go there, to go over there, and then back and do it again. There we go. So, we're going to activate the stick and go all the way in the back there to get the next collectible which I think it's a curiosity or is it a gift? it's a gift that's quite like Dark Souls the sword and the fire anyway here it is here Ballastala it's a tool for calculating distance for what? Whoa. they must use it to adjust firing angles it's rubbish. No, it's not. I'll show you later. So we just need to do the same again. Go all the way over here. Unfortunately, we can't make it to the next bit, so we have to do the same again by getting Thank Lucas to activate this. the trebuchet right. to then get a stick to come back here and go over there. It's quite tedious. Especially for a collectible. But it's a 100% walkthrough and we need to do it. I need you to do this. It was quite cleverly done, this uh, puzzle, should we say. Go in, Hugo. That's it. Can you take care of it? Very well. There we go, we're close to... So we've got our stick. So we're going to activate it and we're going to go over towards the only way and the only light source we can reach to. Hugo did the hard part. I just want us to get out of here. Me too. Come on. So Let's we go. can't actually go anywhere near here. But we've activated the new cutscene. Are we going to go under it? We we'll just have to be careful. We're going to go all the way over here and open this lovely chest. I'm actually going to get to another upgrade station here. And we're going to actually improve the ammunition bag again. So it holds up to 14 ammunition of each type by experimenting actually no I can't do it because I've not got enough alcohol but that's fine we can hold off so we need to actually get this ignited and then run over here and climb over Ready. We're going to have to stay in the light. The cut. 
No. Yes, we need to keep an eye on it. However, it's not that fast. No, run. I'm not sure about this. It's working for now. So somehow. All right. That was awkward. See, sometimes it's weird. It doesn't actually. There, on the tower. Those are bodies, aren't they? Yeah. There we go. So maybe this guy is going to drop something nice. Nope, he's dropped nothing. So there is sticks there, but unfortunately there's nowhere really we can get. So we're going to activate a wee cutscene here. I'll help you up. So we're actually near the end of this chapter. There's an awful lot of them, but we don't have a choice. Courage, lads. I know you're tired. I know there's not enough of us. And I definitely know we'd all like to get far, far away from these fucking rats. But these are our boys. They gave their lives for England. What if it were you? You'd want a decent burial, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Come on then. Guyen is ours. What was that noise? So we're going to continue on as we're near the end literally over that ledge or wall shall we say that'll be it Amicia I'm very tired look there are trees again I think we're getting to the end finally just gonna continue like normal Completing this chapter, we're going to get an achievement and get knocked on the head. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell notification to keep yourself updated. See ya!